Miles here at the Overland Expo. Uh, we're about to go find my five favorite things here, uh, excluding Ranger X, obviously, because, you know, that's one of them. But yeah, let's go. All right, so we're here at the Rivian booth. They brought the R1T out. It's definitely in my top five favorite things. If you guys haven't seen this new electric truck, check it out. Cool facts about this Rivian. So we got a 400 mile range out of an electric truck. Uh, zero to 60 in three seconds. And this thing can actually floor deeper water than most vehicles without snorkels. Amazing Earth Roamer is definitely on my list, so Dylan a few facts. Sure, so this is built on a Ford F550 chassis, and then we make a fiberglass balsa composite shell, and we attach it to the Ford F550. We put it on 41-inch military big block wheels and tires, and this is essentially a self-sufficient off-grid house. So it's got no propane, no generator, solar array on the roof, and a large battery bank. So everything inside can run whether you're plugged in or you're in the middle of nowhere. My next favorite thing is this amazing animal. This Unimog, we were lucky enough to spend the week on the trails with it for the Overland Adventure. So, a few quick stories on this thing because obviously this deck life is amazing. All right, well, I built this, um, I finished it up about seven months ago. It's built on a uh, 2005 Unimog U500 Expedition truck. and. Um, the box is a military surplus. It's called a Gishner box. So I bought the, the box at a military surplus, uh, gutted it out, to uh, cut some doors and windows that I found on eBay, put some Home Depot cabinetry through it, built my bed, solar, microwaves, entertainment system, shower, bath, toilet, the whole nine yards built into this 12-foot uh, box. It's my now little home away from home. This past uh, winter, we spent the, the winter sitting on the beach in South Padre Island. This was our deck, the ocean was there, life is good. All right, I could not walk past this because I literally just found a Defender pre-runner and that makes me very happy. So please tell us a little bit about this thing. I'm uh, Mark from Heritage Driven. We uh, built this truck, it's actually a hunting truck for a client um, that has uh, some Fox shocks under it and a whole bunch of other fun parts, uh, including uh, Dynatrack or Pro Rock 80 in the back and a Pro Rock 60 up front. 418 cubic inch LS motor. I saw trailing arms in the back too. You did. So I see this Fox Air Shock back here. Explain to me what, what this does. So this is actually a game hoist that uh, there's a worn winch up on the top of the cage uh, that's connected to it and the shocks are there to put the pressure on it. So this rack actually unhooks and pivots backwards, it suspends the winch cable so you can pick up an animal trams up and we'll drag the animal back into the truck and the shocks are there to prevent the uh, the rack from falling down. Found a Sherman. I'm so excited. These things are amazing. Uh, this definitely falls into my favorites. It's a fully amphibious, uh, all-terrain vehicle. It goes snow, swamps, logs, rocks, hill climb, sand, water, lakes, rivers. You think of the train, it'll go there. Sorry, honey, I gotta get one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we, I know we said five, we found one more. Uh, the taste in this is excellent because, I mean, it's got a bunch of BDS parts on it. So tell us a little bit about this. So this is a 2015 Ford Transit with a 3.5 liter EcoBoost twin turbo V6 in it. And we did a one ton swap on it. So we put F350 axles under it. Uh, so it's got a Data 60, radius arm Data 60 up front. And a Sterling 10.5 in the rear. And we were able to accomplish that using a bunch of BDS parts and a whole lot of fabrication. And Drove it down here from northern Idaho and just big cruises. So that was my five, 
six favorite things that I found at Overland Expo this year. Uh, sun's going down. We have our big Fox party going on. Um, amazing stuff here. So much more that we can show you. Uh, we had a great time. Guys, we'll see you next year.